Six Life Lessons to Learn from Lord Buddha That Will Help in Spiritual Awakening Lord Buddha, the Enlightened One, left a plethora of teachings and lessons that continue to guide millions today on their spiritual journey. His wisdom and the importance and relevance of his teachings are not just important to Buddhists all over the world, but also people of different religions who find peace in his teachings. Here we list six important life lessons to learn from Lord Buddha that are not just relevant in everyday life but have also helped many on their spiritual journey. Number 2. Be Mindful. At the core of Lord Buddha's teachings is mindfulness. Now, what exactly is mindfulness? Mindfulness is the simple practice of paying attention to the present moment with openness and acceptance. By developing mindfulness, people become more aware of their thoughts, emotions, and actions, allowing them to break free from the cycle of unconscious living. When someone starts practicing mindfulness, the occasional episodes of things getting blurry or forgetting things immediately start to lessen and they can finally live fully in each moment. Which quote did you like the most? Share your opinion in the comments. Don't miss out of chance. See the next video. Subscribe. Number 3. Accept that nothing is permanent. Lord Buddha taught that everything in life is impermanent, subject to change. By accepting and embracing the impermanent nature of all things, us humans can let go of attachments and expectations, leading to greater peace and contentment. Recognizing the changing nature of life allows us to appreciate each moment fully without clinging to the past or fearing the future outcomes of certain events and things. To practice this, it is important to learn to let go. Practice letting go of attachments by releasing your mind's grip on things that no longer serve you well and are best left in the past. Number 4. Be compassionate. Compassion lies at the heart of Lord Buddha's teachings, emphasizing empathy and kindness towards all. By developing a sense of compassion, it is easier to remove the barriers of separation and connect more deeply with others. Compassion enables us to rise above suffering, both in ourselves and in the world around us. Being compassionate is not just a lesson given by Buddha but also a basic concept of life. To live a more fulfilled life it is important to take part in acts of kindness and service, no matter how small. Number 5. Let go of your ego. Thousands of years ago, Lord Buddha identified the ego, or the sense of self, as the root cause of suffering. Through attachment to the ego, we create divisions between ourselves and others, leading to conflict and discontent. By removing this sense of ego or trying to rise above it, we realize interconnectedness with all beings, experiencing true freedom and liberation. And the simplest way to let go of your ego is to observe the ways in which your ego emerges and tries to mess with your thoughts, beliefs, and behaviors. Along with that, practice letting go of the need for validation and approval from others. Number 6. Believe in Non-Attachment. Non-attachment to the material aspects of life is the key to leave and rise above suffering, and this rule forms a major part of Buddha's teachings. By giving up your attachment to desires or outcomes, you will slowly free yourself from the grip of craving something and revolving your life around something. Non-attachment is not just about detachment or indifference but rather a deep acceptance of life as it happens, without clinging or resistance. Number 7. Realize Your Purpose. Lord Buddha emphasized the importance of living with purpose and intention, aligning our actions with our deepest values and aspirations. By living with purpose, we find meaning and fulfillment in every aspect of our lives, contributing to the well-being of ourselves and others. To practice this, reflect on your values, passions, and aspirations to clarify your sense of purpose. Set meaningful goals that align with your values and commit to taking action towards their realization. Which quote did you like the most? Share your opinion in the comments. Don't miss out of chance. See the next video. Subscribe.